ESOP's revolutionary SmartVIC feature on their ESOP Rebel EMP 215. Uh, what I want to do is I want to show you what is different between our ESOP Rebel and the competition, and I also want to show you how it's going to help you improve your, your welding technique. So what we're going to do is we're going to set up the machine for the SmartVIC process, and all you do is you go into the home menu and you select SmartVIC, and you select your wire diameter, and we're using 035. That, next, you're going to set your material thickness, and we're going to weld on 8th inch material. And you just you select your thickness right up here with the, with the uh, knob on the top right corner of the panel. Set that up for 8th inch, and I'm ready to go. This machine doesn't care what material type and what gas you have hooked up to the machine. It will tune in the optimal short arc for your electrical stick out, travel speed, and torch angle, along with the wire type and the gas combination. So this machine is going to tune itself in. It is adapted, unlike anybody else on the market. What we're going to do is we're going to have Harleen make a well with the Smart MIG feature. And what this machine is going to do, it's going to tune into her electrical stick out, travel speed, and work angle and it's gonna give her the optimal short arc for her welding characteristics. And you're gonna see the machine tune the arc voltage to her welding characteristics. You'll see it happen on the panel. She will feel it in the arc. And then we'll demonstrate why this is different than the competition. Here's what the machine is actually doing for the operator. We're going to shut off the gas to demonstrate this. And what you're going to see is the arc voltage increase based on, the, based on the fact that there is no gas in the process. The machine is trying to find the optimal short arc in that condition. So when we shut off the gas, it automatically will increase arc voltage to find the best arc. It is not recommended to weld without gas. However, to show you the capability of this machine and what it's doing, I will have Harley make a weld without gas. And then we'll turn the gas back on and make another weld and you'll see how the machine tunes itself in. So now we're gonna turn the gas on we're going to have Harleen make a weld with the gas, and what we'll see is the arc voltage moved from 22 and a half volts down to probably around 17 volts based on her electrical stick out, travel speed, and work angle. What the Rebel is doing is adapting to a few things. What the wire material type is, what the gas type is, what the operator's electrical stick out, travel speed, and torch angle is, and it's trying to tune in the optimal short arm for your application. What this is going to help you do is create better welds. It's going to help you develop yourself a lot quicker as you practice the welding process and you become an expert in the industry. So thank you, Harleen. Thank you. And we appreciate you coming to the website. Visit bakersgas.com and purchase your Rebel today. For more information or to purchase an ESOP Rebel, visit bakersgas.com, enter promo code REBEL215 to receive $50 off.